Is that your new tape? Star-Lord? Who's the guy with the scary eyes? He doesn't have a name. He's one of the Space Riders. And he's not scary. He's cool. Your Space Rider certainly got his hands full. Pretty far out! Nobody says far out anymore, Ma. <laughs> Ma! What? Nobody says far out anymore. Oh, well, your mom does. Maybe we should see if we could get tickets to see them live. Really? Mm hmm Your mom may not look it, but I was quite the rocker when I was your age. Your father and I would just lie on the hood of my old Chevy and listen to Black Sabbath and... You like Black Sabbath? Like I said, your mom's cooler than you think. Oh, we'd look up at the stars and he'd... Tell me all about the places he'd been. Mom? How about some cake, huh? Yeah, I'll be up in a sec. You said that 15 minutes ago. If you don't hurry, I'm gonna eat that whole cake myself. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I would. <laughs> you wouldn't. Yes, I would. Hey, watch the hair. <laughs> We've talked about you leaving your toys on the floor. It's not a toy. It's an action figure. More like an action landmine. Stab your foot. I will. He doesn't even... Never mind. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec. I promise. Right. Three natural ones in a row last game? Some barn I turned out to be. Oh man, I can't wait to play this. Maybe I can convince Andy to buy it with his paper out money. This will be worth hundreds of dollars someday. Hitting those dingers, George, and he'll make it in the Hall of Fame for sure. Might as well just peel the stickers off and put them in the right spot. doing this man it's weird we are approaching the quarantine zone how long was I out for 15,338 ticks that's very specific the betrayer is ready to begin our mission she has requested your presence in the cockpit the Mora's on our side Drax she is the spawn of my sworn enemy a murderess and a traitor I do not trust her we'll try we're supposed to be a team I make no promises.
Whoa, it ain't just the junkyard. The quarantine zone's the biggest pile of galactic war debris in the known universe. Just think of all the tech we can find. I am Groot. Ah, there you are, Quill. Tell Groot to stop worrying about getting arrested. I am Groot. I'm not overconfident. I'm just the right level of confident. <laughs> Arrested? For what? <sighs> our ship just accidentally slipped into the quarantine zone. Oops, our navigation malfunctioned. Oops. <sighs> How would we accidentally cross into the Nova Corps force field? <sighs> Details! <sighs> Mora? Up here, Peter. Hey, that's my chair. Oh, then why aren't you in it? I was, uh, strategizing. Uh, it's one thing to get into the zone, but we still gotta catch that monster. Right. So did I miss anything? Other than a ton of suspicious glares from Drax, not really. Now, if you're done strategizing. Feel free to grab your seat. We're almost ready to go. Okay, here we go. Rocket, Groot, Drax, get in here. We're going in. We still have a few ticks before the next time window, actually. The next one? Nova Corps security guard resets every rotation. We want to be in and out before our code expires, or we'll get stranded. And if we wait for the next reset, we'll get a full rotation to do this. Nice. <laughs> oh, why is the Nova Net still up? Thought we were going in. Well, it appears the Assassin's contacts are as untrustworthy as the betrayer herself. Oh, please don't tell me Gamora's backdoor codes are bust. We nearly went broke getting them. Relax, Rocket. We still got a few ticks before the next time window. The network just reset. You can enter the sequence, Peter. 0451. That's it? Four digits? Suspicious. These security measures are too simplistic for Novacore. It's not that simple. The code only works on this date for this ship. Oh, I get it. Gamora's codes are more like an encryption key of some sort, designed to integrate temporal... There. So much stuff left after the war. Restraint wasn't very popular in the Shatari army, especially with Thanos in charge. Yeah, it's probably all harmless now. I mean, Novacore had 12 years to get rid of the heavy duty explosives, right? <laughs> That's why I like you, Quill. You're so cool. Oh, the wonderful and terrible things I could do with all this tech. Stay focused, Rodent. We do not come here to scavenge. Why not? The Milano's weapon systems could use an overall. Plus, there's good money in it. The beast that we seek is far more valuable to the Monster Queen of Seknoth 9 than any illegally acquired salvage. Whoa! Oh, place is really shifty. I'm not seeing a monster, but that big cylinder up ahead looks like mining ship Peter's friend said to look for. <clears throat> friend? For a night? And you'll see the monster as soon as we place Rocket's monster summoning thingies. Flark, yeah. Group Quell Soda. Team Rocket's up first. I still do not understand why I must remain on board with the Assassin. Oh, because you're part of Green Team. You assigned me to the team before you named it. My skin is not green. It's teal. Teal? Listen, if we want to trick the monster into going inside that mining rig, we need to place thumpers on both sides. Two sides, two teams. And two clicks to the drop side. The ground's too unstable to land the ship, so you'll need to jump. That's our cue. Let's go, group. <laughs> Don't worry! 
Once the thumpers are placed, we'll meet in the middle and we'll capture the monster. Together. Very well. Child. Oh, oh, can you imagine? I am Groot. What, the pink goop? It's custom nano resin, designed to keep all this war stuff from floating away. I am Groot. Nah, it's totally safe. Now, can we please focus less on the toxic goo and more on all this cool war junk it's holding together? I'm broke. I didn't mean toxic, toxic. More, uh, don't put it in your mouth, toxic. How many of these ships did you personally destroy, assassin? In this massive junkyard, filled with debris from both sides of the war. Man, these missiles were devastating during the war. Wonder if any still work. You tell me, visor boy. I'm thinking that big cylinder thing is our rendezvous? Yeah, that's the mining rig. So weird seeing it all clustered together like this. Bits and pieces of a war that spanned the entire galaxy held together by... pink goo. Ebrium-based nano-resin. Whatever. I'm just saying, it's a lot to take in. <laughs> oh, look! Yellow and blue. Looks like an old Novacore frigate. Nice! Come on, dude. People probably died on that ship. Killjoy, why do you even bring us here if the place is so sacred? I can name at least a dozen planets with monsters on them, so why here? Don't know if you noticed, Rocket, but people aren't exactly falling over themselves to hire us. Oh, I have noticed. If this job pans out, sure we'll get money, but also a rich new client. We need to impress Lady Hellbender with a monster she's interested in, not just any old critter. Which is why we should- Whoa! Okay. I'm okay! Ha! <laughs> Almost made yourself a very late war casualty. Not funny. You know, I like this. This is fun. <laughs> The three of us, hanging out, just like when we started this gig, before you-know-who joined us. I am Quill. I do not hate everybody. I tolerate Quill. Quill's a, a swell guy. Come on, Rocket. Drax and Gamora are valued additions to the team. You're only saying that because she's listening. Is that why your plan has Drax and I taking the ship? Maybe. Hey, can't a guy want to spend some quality time with his friends? Whoa! Pretty sure that way's a dead end. Eh, uh, you sure? Ah, there we go. Path's this way. Come on! How can you even tell? Just trust me, all right? Hey, group. you think we could find pieces of the Trion shard in here? How'd you even know the other way was a dead end? Because, unlike you, I have a very keen sense of direction. Whoa! <clears throat> Watch your step, guys. This junk isn't as stable as we think. Uh, that is one big mushroom. Take that, brittle stuff. Uh, I hate these ship-eating parasites. Larkas would chew right through the Milano in two cycles. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> nice splatter. Hey. Fifty units says I can clear more of these suckers than you. As if. Whoa, what the? Rocket, did you do that? The scoreboard? You like it? Hacked it into your visor cover last time you took a snooze. You hacked into my stuff? 
Considering how many times I fixed the Flarkin thing, it might as well be my stuff. Optimal thumper placing distance should be just up ahead. I'm good. I'm thinking right in front, through the giant hole where this ship's cockpit... <laughs> Amazing! I should have been recording. Bridge over, Groot. I want to see if he's alive. I am Groot. I don't know, but he's twitching. Flarkin, Scott Stain, Quill. You okay down there? Yep. Yeah, just, uh... Thought I saw a shortcut. shortcut. Right. Go ahead without me. I'll catch up. Okay. There's a craft out Novacore missile bay just on the other side. We'll meet you there. Yellow and blue missile bay. Got it. Kind of scrap we're looking for. Way to go, Lord! Trying to bring the whole place down, Quill. I shot a thing. I get it. First tool in the old toolbox. Ooh, don't die! Don't die! Don't die! Oh, hey, little guy. Dead Quill, we can hear your wussy squeal even without the cops. A little busy. Crap! That's cheating. You guys should have seen that. It was this weird blobby thing. <laughs> Not falling for this again. Fight with dignity, Peter Quill. Or at least die with it. Not funny. It is good to be doing physical labor again. Kinda hard to believe you were a farmer. I was a warrior. But working the soil can be as satisfying as battle. I am Groot. I really doubt pulling weeds is as good as pulling heists. Monster, we really should spend half a cycle loading up the Milano with tech. The longer we stay here, the higher the chances of us getting caught. Uh, Quill, we got a lot riding on your gal pal's mystery monster tip. I hope she's legit. Like, you could even tell if she had an honest face. Trust in the plan, guys. Everything is checked out so far, right down to the mining ship. We put our thumpers in the right places, and we'll bag that monster. Side. 
Get Groot to grow a bridge across. Just ask him nicely. He does it for me all the time. All right, Groot. Let's see that cool vine. Oh, That's one hell of a party trick, big guy. Gross. More ship eaters. Ah, oh, they're everywhere. All right. Boom. Right under your nose, Quill. Do I look worried? The resin will hold. I am Groot. You ain't that heavy. We gotta go that way, across the gap, somehow. I am Groot. Yeah, it's close enough for Groot to bridge if you can find a proper handhold. Nova Centurions probably had to tow all the scrap to one place. I am Groot. Look for one of them support bars on the other side there. Groot, I found a hitch. Can you latch onto it? Hey, Greenies. If you see any blue and gold ships out there, you'll let us know. We have seen many such ships. He means active ones. We haven't talked about what to do if we run into a Nova Corps patrol. Uh, we'll restrain them until we are done here. Bad idea. If you see cops, you get my ship out of here. Even if it means leaving us behind. Uh, flark that! Trust me, I've dealt with Nova Corps before. Even helped them catch real criminals. I can talk my way out. You think that Milano can outrun a fully powered Nova Centurion? She's done it before. Gamora, when are you gonna share your contacts and sources? When will you share yours? What? You know about all my guys. Only that you've got a guy that makes the booms, you've got a guy who can read. Okay, here we go. All right, set her down right there. Yep, one to go. Flark! No, no! Flark and Skaggy! Attack and batteries fried, that's what's wrong. Maybe you put it down too hard. Let's just find a solution. The solution's a new battery, with a charge. Okay, we're on what's left of a ship. Full of ship things. Gotta be things that power ship things around here, right? Yeah. Maybe you're gonna want to use your visor for this. You find a replacement while I finish scraping the fried wires. Peter Quill, the double agent is trying to lull me into a false sense of security. Right. And the moment you drop your guard, I'll strike. <laughs> hey! A huge power generator! How do we hook it up? We don't! That thing would toast our little bumper. Can't we condense the power through a routing funnel or something? Don't try to make up tech stuff. It's irritating. Find something else. Of course we're going the right way. Just keep your eyes on that mining ship. That's where we want to end up. What's a mining ship doing in the middle of all these fighters, anyway? Eh, they don't call them casualties of war for nothing. Uh, of course it's the worst space ration flavor. This one tastes like dollar store cat food. Makes her teeth oily. Well, come on, man. So, Drax. How come you're so in love with this Hellbender lady? I do not love Lady Hellbender. Yeah, shouldn't you be all like, Her name is illogical, but you cannot bend hell. That does not at all resemble me. <laughs> Got an oxygen pump here! No good. It would draw power directly from the ship. Right! 
Yeah, I knew that. We know the monster we're looking for ain't one of these things we already killed. If it were worthy of Lady Hellbender's collection, it would not die so easily. Hope we know this thing when we see it and not after we stomped it. Something with a charge. Kind of looks like a spacey car battery. Okay, this thing isn't gonna zap me, right? The chance is minuscule at best. You'll be fine. What are you waiting for, Quill? Grab it. Here you go. That'll do nicely. Just let me tinker a bit. I'll have to do some tweaking once I see how much juice this thing puts out. So uh, watch my back. Watch it from what? Just grab the battery and give it a yank! Rocket! Help me scramble some critters! No, 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 Scott! If I don't rewire this fast, it's gonna short circuit! Fucking monster thing! One last freaky eye thing! Done! 
We're all plugged in. Wow. Just in time. I'd like to see you fix it next time. Come on. Two down, two to go. Groot's wondering if the reward's gonna be worth all the risk we're taking for this job. Me and Groot are nearly unkillable, but what if the rest of you don't make it out alive? Guys, we deliver this monster to Lady Hellbender, we'll get bigger payouts, and jobs that don't suck. A ship for each one of us! I mean, a team only needs one ship. Perhaps a more spacious ship. What? No! I love my baby! We can modify her. I'd kill for a gunner's rotunda. We'll think about it. I'm Groot. Groot wants a plant! Groot, man! We will get you two plants! I'm Groot! Man! That thing is ridiculous! I think it was a ship or a robot? That's a Cree Sentry. A robot, but it would have been space worth. <laughs> that ain't even the biggest one. They designed at least five experimental models twice that size. How do you know all this? Because they were my fellow experiments back on Half World. Most of my parts came from the cybernetics hangar next to the door, so uh, I got a sneak peek at all the new killbots. I could see the parts come and go from my uh, uh, my cage. I didn't mean to open old wounds. Eh, most of them are just scars now anyways. I wasn't even a person to the worst of the Kree's mad scientists. More like a real smart walking gun. A very talkative gun. <laughs> yeah, that part was an accident. They tried to fix it a few times. I am Groot. The entire facility was the problem. I wish I'd gone back and blown it up before the end of the war. Yeah, that would have been a killing blow. Ha! Not even close! I can hear your visor working. Better not be cheating on our bet, Quill. How can you hear that? Groot, need you to shoot a bridge right into that eye socket. Now, I want to see you do that to something in combat. Wait, is that... Yes! I'm about to win this match, Inside a giant robot head. And I got robot parts inside my head. You have robot parts inside your head. Inside a giant robot head. Down it. Rocket scores! Ooh. Hey, Groot, what do you think I should do when I win this bet? I'm Groot. I mean, with the units still owe me once I win. Bam! <laughs> Well, I know what I'll be doing with my winnings. I'm saving up for our next stop on Contraxia to get one of those Zeronian massages. Ugh, you're so predictable. Uh, you know what, Quill? I think it's unfair. You got two guns, I got one. I think my points could count double from now on. That's cheating. All right, Thumper goes there, Quill. It's not gonna piss off every critter around, right? Sorry, Quill. Not taking no chances after the last one. I gotta test it real quick. Not again. Rocket! I only flipped the switch on and off to see if it started. Gotta love that kill radius. Missing all the fun last time. Move it. Not a chance. I've got to wait. Don't feel bad, buddy. They started it. How are there this many of them? Oh, come on! Now we gotta deal with junk slugs? 
Don't talk at it! Shoot it! Very helpful, thanks! You're welcome! Now stop distracting me! What's next, Peter? Take this! Points like that. Team, looks like we're done installing our thumper. Great job. We'll meet you at the mining ship. right there of course it's secure as secure as a broke down shatari shipwrecks ever gonna be I am Groot. that's cuz you keep calling it gooey stuff it's nano resin I am Groot. come on Groot we need to get across here a rocket wouldn't put you at risk right I am Groot. that's right I've always got your back but Nah, it just looks unstable like everything else in here. Don't get your twigs in a bundle. Yes! The resin can hold a stupid warship! <laughs> I'm telling you, it's totally safe. See? I'll even prove it. Huh? Look at this. This rocket? Oh, fuck. at the mining ship. I don't want to make him wait. That's it? We're not going after him? He says it's fine. We'll meet him later. Team Rocket, is everything okay? Groot's signal just went dark. His radio must have broke when he fell. What happened to your timber companion? Rocket knocked an old shipwreck off balance and we lost Groot. What? Is he hurt? I didn't do nothing. It fell on its own. And Groot's fine. Team Rocket out. Why'd you have to go and tell Green Team the accident's my fault? 
fruit's fine anyways. There's nothing to worry about. Not like I could have prevented that old rusted ship from keeling over. How do you make a dead Shatari float? How? You take your foot off its head. <laughs> I think Yondu told me that one. Only good Shatari is a dead Shatari. Yeah, Korax was okay. I wonder how he's doing. Hey, hey. What gets louder as it gets smaller? I don't know. A Shatari in a trash compact. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that one's rough, but good. Man, if that afterburner kicked on right now, we'd be toast. Let's hope it don't. Because we have to find a way through this thing. Tiny ships on the other side of that turbine, so we gotta find a way through. Try not to jump on anything this time. Groot's not there to grab you if you... Well, either shut up or help me figure out how these blades open. Hard to believe all this destruction's because some ugly flarkin bugs got up at It was a little more complex than that. Don't matter. We should have thrown everything at the bug homeworld and exterminated the flark. We did, but they surrendered. That don't change my opinion on the matter. There's a drone access tunnel over here. Too bad we don't got a drone. <sighs> Can you squeeze in there? Knew it. Rocket, fix the thing. Rocket, clean up the mess. Rocket, crawl into the mystery hole. See anything? Yeah, a manual override. Team Rocket, we hit a snag. One of our thumper points was covered in resin, so we're gonna fly around and scout another spot. Just make sure the new spot as close as possible to the original one. Because of maps and angles. Great, another turbine. Yeah, that is how these things are usually built. And... Boop! Pew! Pew! Come on! Let's get out of here! Closer than ten Shatari nailed to a ship. I don't know what. One Shatari nailed the ten ships. We're back on track. The mining ship ain't too far. Think Groot's already ahead of us? Maybe. Hope he didn't get distracted. It wasn't me this time, I swear! Stop walking around! 
what? My visor went supernova. Is it broken? Uh, overloaded, sounds like. Must be some kind of residual energy in here. Oh, come on! Clark and Tensor Joint just need to uh, wiggle the... Uh, okay, so life support's booting back up. What's it look like out there? Oh, mother of space bar... It's just... Man. of old cleaner bots maybe old cleaner bots you don't know <laughs> 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 Sorry about the shooting. Yeah, thought you were that freaky thing we accidentally released. Saw! We saw some cleaner bots. <laughs> accidentally. At a distance. <laughs> we're totally all right. They just ran away when it saw us. Right, Quill? Rocket, I'm not so sure that swarm thing was inoffensive. I feel kind of bad about releasing it. <laughs> Quill took a pot shot at this massive worm nest. A chunk of something fell off and the big floaty creature came out of it. That's all. Here you go. Rendezvous coordinates are that way. But we'll have to find a way around the rubble. I'll try to find a side passage. There's a doorway behind that big thing. Someone help me push it. Look at this old beauty. A table. This is a vintage Model T engineering workbench. They don't make them sturdy like that no more. Hey, come on, Quill. Let's see if this beauty still works. Maybe I can fix up your gear. Hey, hand me that part. Small marvel crafted. Yeah, there's a way through if we can clear out that crush. Yeah, that's one stubborn bunch of war. Try that quick cooldown I installed, so you can keep pelting it. Come on, Quill. Put them pea shooters to good use, so we can squeeze in there. Gotta time it just right to overcharge the phase cooling. Why'd I even bother upgrading those things if you aren't gonna use them? <laughs> Fastest gun in the Ionian cluster.
sucks to get busted in here. You know, with just one exit. Is that supposed to make me feel better? Anyone else get a weird vibe off this place? And, uh, thanks for the upgrade. Shit's been messing up our comms. Yeah, something really ain't right in here. And Quill fell down another hole. Another one. I'm parking the Milano, but Drax is out there searching for you. Maybe you'll find Quill before we do. We're trying to catch up to him. Guys, we really need to get better at the buddy system. She is not my buddy. I will find you, Peter Quill. Describe your surroundings. Uh, old metal, old mining equipment, just old. Noted. What a weird bunch of stuff to mine. What was it? I don't know. Weird QB hunks of rock or metal. You two have any luck? It is not a question of luck. Peter, make some noise so we can find you. Drax? Drax? Hey, you want to mute your comms if you're going to scream your lungs out? Located some old equipment, but I do not see you. This whole place is old equipment. That does not narrow my search. Hello? Oh, another freaky thing! How freaky? Kill it! You read my mind! The king refuses to die! I can barely scratch it! Kill it harder! Oh, I'm killing it as hard as I can! Soft 
flesh is prime for slicing. What is that? My turn! Deadliest woman incoming! Nice to meet you! Crab's dead! Going to kill something else! Indeed. You greenies found Quill yet? Found and saved. Hey. Go on ahead then. We'll catch up. Just making a uh, pit stop. I parked the Milano near the last thumper spot. We'll head that way and keep an eye out for you. How's my baby? You can see for yourself if we can get back up there. I could make it up there, but we're gonna need something for you two to climb up on. It is a wonder the nimble assassin has not abandoned us already. Drax. At least he called me nimble. Let's see that fancy footwork, Gamora. Bet you can't do this. That is physically impossible. Okay, sort of making progress. Drax, any thoughts? I am debating whether to employ the Kershagar lunge to subdue our monster. And whether that would be inadvertently fatal. Drax, think you can heft that container? Behold the might of a Katathian warrior! You can put it down here. I am on my way. Remember this moment should you ever think of crossing me, assassin. All right, Rocket. We're back on track. Huh? Oh, yeah, uh, good for you. I am Groot. It ain't stealing if it's abandoned. We... Oh, Flark. Rocket. I am Groot. Not now, Quill. Rocket. Perhaps he has located our monster. We don't even know what it looks like. The intel was extremely vague. It wasn't vague, it was... rushed. It's probably some cute little... Nightmarish abomination. Lady Hellbender is a renowned warrior. An ideal specimen would reflect that strength. Like I said, something scary. I disagree. Strength is endearing, 